After the first case of bird flu was detected in the Texas Panhandle two months ago, the city of Austin reported last week that it found traces of the virus right in its wastewater system. So we wanted to know our health officials here in Harris County seeing anything similar. ABC 13's Rosie Wynn joining us live from the newsroom. Okay, Rosie, what have you been able to find out? Well, Myra and Jonathan, we first brought this question to Harris County Public Health on Friday, and as of tonight, we are still waiting for an answer back. However, I did speak to somebody at the state health department, and they tell me that even if the answer to this question is yes, it doesn't necessarily mean that there are people in our communities who are infected. This is how it was explained to me. There's a number of reasons why the bird flu could be detected in wastewater. It doesn't necessarily have to be through human transmission. Traces of the dead virus could still be detected in milk that has been pasteurized if the milk came from a cow with the bird flu. So if someone pours milk from a sick cow down the drain, that could be one way that it ends up in the wastewater system. But remember, that milk still has no risk to us if it's been pasteurized. Right now, state officials say there have been no human cases detected in Austin and the risk to the public is very low. And so that's one of the things that could be going on here, where you have milk that, you know, is coming from cows in another part of the state, um, you, you know, being processed in an area, whether that's in Austin, in Houston, somewhere else, um, you know, some of that milk may be going, you know, down the drain into the sewer system. Experts say the people who are most at risk to this are those working with farm animals. There hasn't been any additional human cases reported in Texas since that first one in April. The state health department says that person recovered fairly quickly and only experienced conjunctivitis, which is redness in the eye. Now, one thing experts want us to remember that as of right now, the virus is not spreading from human to human. So that's why there's not much cause for concern. However, remember viruses can mutate, so that is definitely something experts will be watching for. Reporting live from the newsroom, Rosie Wynn, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.